The NHL season is quickly approaching. With Puck Drop on October 1st, Proto 3000 decided to 3D print a puck. We wanted to mimic the characteristics of a regular puck as closely as possible, so we went with a digital mix of Vero White Plus and Tango Black Plus at a short value of A95. The next step was to test out its performance. Hey guys, Daniel here with Proto 3000. We're at the rink today testing out our 3D printed puck. We got our buddy Jeff, who's a former AHL player, to help us out with some friction, high impact testing, see how this thing holds up to a couple slap shots. So let's get started. I think it'll do all right. Only time will tell. If it's the same weight, it should have the same characteristics. Surprisingly, really, really nice. A little on the smooth side, but it had it felt the same coming off the stick. I, I when I stick handled the two pucks, um, I could just felt more rigidity, where the puck had a little bit more give, and then maybe that's just because I'm used to the puck. Uh, other than lightness, I, I I say it was very similar. Most kids would not know the difference. So there you have it guys, as you can see it stood up to some high impact friction testing, a couple crossbars, some hard slap shots, and it came out with just a few minor scratches on it, it actually held up really well. Just goes to show you the potential of 3D printing and how it can be used in many different industries.